Hello, it's the start of the weekend vlog. It's Friday morning, it's the 8th of March and it is 10 past nine. I'm in Great Yarmouth town centre um, and I've got to put a check in the bank. What else have I got to do? I don't know, something else. I've got to, oh, petrol, I've got to get some petrol and look in the charity shops. That's on my to-do list as well. So a few little jobs I've got to do. So I thought I would start it here. The weather's nice, it's sunny. It's only about six degrees, but it feels warm. The sun is quite warm. This is the quay in Great Yarmouth. There's a little bridge over there. I like that bridge. You can see the blue bridge amongst the cars. Little flowers are out. Historic Great Yarmouth. I'll just show you the town hall, which is a really nice building really busy this morning everywhere with the cars. Look how lovely it is. Almost 20 past nine. I don't think I've been in the town hall. Right, I'm going to go up this way to the Sue Rider charity shop. Oh, there's a really nice hotel over there, the Star Hotel. That's a lovely, a lovely hotel. I've been there for a wedding. There's a really nice Mylene class, like Mac, um, for five pounds, but I wouldn't wear it, but it would be a really good buy. It's very nice. I just came outside and spotted a lovely dress on this lady, so I grabbed it off her. I left her with a little hairband though, and some earrings and some shoes, and the dress is in my bag. I'll show you when I get in the car. And it was only three pounds. I'm just gonna head to the bank. Just in the East Coast Hospice shop in the Yarmouth having a little look. It's 20 past 10 now and I'm back in the car and I put the cheque in the bank so that's all done and this is the dress that I got from Sue Ryder in Great Yarmouth, the Mylene class dress. I just saw it as I left the shop and you saw the lady, I had to leave her the mannequin all naked, poor thing, she must have been very cold. Um, it's really nice, I love these little hearts, it's got a little collar and then um, like a tea dress kind of thing, it goes in at the waist and then flares out and it's got bell sleeves, which I don't love. However, I really like this dress and it kind of goes with it because it's all a bit flowy. Love those hearts. So I didn't get the Mylene class Mac. I kind of felt like maybe I should, but it's not really something I would wear. So I left the Mac for someone else to find, but I got the Mylene class dress. And yeah, I think it's lovely. I love this kind of like water, watercolor hearts. Um, it's very nice. Um, so that's all I got really. Got a couple of books, that dress, um, and now I'm gonna head back home to have some breakfast. I've got Bestie here, wondering what's going on. What's all the racket? And it is, of course, Rufa! Sit, stay, no, sit, 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 stay, sit. Rufus, do you want to <laughs> sit? Where's he going to go? Anywhere? No, he's staying there. Bestie's had some cat treats today. It wasn't, he wasn't quite so excited. Rufus, was that nice? Was that a good gravy bone? Oh, was that? There was more gravy bone there. No, if you jump up, there's a bit of gravy bone. Oh, well, there was. There was. Where's it gone? Where's it gone? There it is. Oh, got a bit of gravy bone. Do you want a bit of? Gravy bone. <laughs> yeah. It's Friday afternoon, it's three o'clock and I'm off to get Toby from school. Then we're going to drive to Norwich for football practice and then um, my mum is going to be looking after Toby tonight because I've got a gig at Seashore Holiday Park and I've got to be there for about half past seven. So that is what I'm doing. So I better get a move on and um, pick Toby up. I'm at Seashore Holiday Park in Great Yarmouth and the time is 7.30 so I'm just quickly getting ready um, and I think I'm going on in about five minutes. Hopefully the crowd will be nice and then I've got a little break in between then back on for the second half. I think around like half past eight. Hello, it's Saturday morning. It's about 9.30 and um, I'm just about to go into Lidl. I've dropped Toby off to football practice and I thought I'd go to Lidl to get a few bits and we all want some 
bacon rolls this morning so that's what I'm gonna go and have a look for and maybe I'll have a look at the gin because we're all out of gin it was all drunk last weekend um, with the girls so yeah I'm gonna go into Lidl Lee is away at the moment he's in America on a working holiday he's so lucky so there's no Lee which is sad but he'll be back soon um, so yeah, that's all I'm doing just popping into Lidl um, and then later on today I've got a gig at Hopton Holiday Park and it's they've got a whole um, They've got a brand new venue, I think. They've just opened it up and spent lots of money on it. And they've got a day of entertainment and I'm on at four o'clock. Um, so that should be really nice. I love singing at that holiday park. Um, so that's what I'm doing today. And the weather's quite nice, actually. It's blue skies. I think it's around 11 degrees. Um, it's a bit windy though. I think I'm gonna get a couple of these. Um, I want one in the bathroom and maybe one for the bedroom. And 2 is a really good price. So I'll just choose a couple of these. I think this one looks nice. So I'll get that one and quite like the look of a purpley one or shall I go for I like that one I'm gonna get that okay to get some advice from Mr Carrington this is always my favorite bit in Lidl the bakery bit we'll get a couple of these these are really good these um espresso compatible capsules just seen these little llama lunch boxes they're very cute little coffee cup flamingo one other llama but i've got enough um coffee cups but they're very sweet uh oh it's the middle aisle it's gonna be quick though i don't need underpants gonna get a newspaper for my mum this is the one she likes we've got some really nice little books for 99p the wind in the willows and the wizard of oz so i'm gonna get these for toby some really nice bedtime reading quite long stories too and there's black beauty alice in wonderland i think treasure island is there I'm back from Lidl's now, so I'll just quickly show you what I bought. Um, it turned out to be quite a big shop in the end. I only went in for bacon and rolls, but that's always that's the way with Lidl, isn't it? You just see things. So this is everything I bought, the two succulents. I got some whoopsed flowers. So these ones, tulips, they were £1.32 and they look quite nice. They don't look like they've, you know, they're on their way out. And then these ones, the spring bouquet, and that was £2, what does that say? 80 I think, and they look lovely. So I'll put those together because I would give some to my mum. Oh, that was my scarf jumping in the shot then. Um, I would give some to my mum, but she already has some. She's got a huge big um, thing of flowers from my dad. I went for this gin, the gin liqueur. This is so nice and it's not quite as strong. It's 20%. So um, last weekend's gin was very strong, so that I'm, I'm going to have one of those later when I've finished work with one of these tonic waters. Um, I'm not sure, that was 9 99 and I think these were like £1.29. I got some whoopsed bread. How much was that? Uh, 58p. Newspaper for my mum. Lou Roll was 1 99 The books were 99p. Some croissants for Toby in the morning, because he likes that he likes those. And I think they were like £1.19. And for dinner tonight, I bought these. I thought they looked lovely. They're just really easy. So chicken enchiladas and a beef burrito. So we'll just share them. I think me, Toby, and my mum. And they were two pounds nine P each. I thought I'd try this shampoo. It looks like the Aussie shampoo, so um I thought I'd give that a go. I like the look of these, these pair um travel sweets. Some mints, uh the nespresso y capsule things. Um, rolls for the bacon rolls, bacon, and that was, whoops, that was down to, what have we got, how much, £1.32. So I'll probably use one and put one in the freezer. Um, I think that's it. So that is my little food haul with a few homey bits. So I'll put those in pots later. I'll work out how to do it. I might send a message to Mr Carrington for his advice. I've just taken a photo for Instagram of this little bit here for my house account. And Toby had the idea of putting the um, blankets in this basket and I'm just trying to cover up Bestie's cat scratches. Um, and then over here are the flowers that I bought this morning. But there's so many leaves, I took some of them off. So I don't know if you're meant to take the leaves off or not. I don't really know. I need to look into flower arranging. I do like buying flowers, but um, they look, I don't know. Are you meant to... I don't really do anything with them. I don't, do I? But you're not meant to. You... That's Toby. Hello! Hello. <laughs> you had your football practice today, didn't you? Yeah. Was it good? 
and I've got a match tomorrow. I'm just having a little snuggle. I'll make bacon sandwiches in a minute. Yay. So, but you like these flowers, don't you? You said they look really pretty, but we're just not sure whether to take the leaves off, the onion bits. <laughs> Toby said they were like onions, we pull some off. Anyway, so if you've got yeah, any tips. Like white bit, like a... Yeah, on the stalk, like celery. Yeah. <laughs> like onions, like spring onion. Yeah. yeah. Um, so if you have any tips about flowers or flower arranging, I'll, I'll find a video maybe and see, but they look quite pretty. So uh, just a little picture like this. So um, yeah, I'm gonna put that on Instagram in a minute. Bacon rolls are all ready and some have even got cheese in. They look quite good. And this is my mum's section of the garden. See how windy it is out here. Crazy windy. I'll just close that. Love this bit though, it's one of my favourite parts of the garden. I like being in that corner there. You can see a chair. Oh, it's really windy. I like sitting there <laughs> when it's sunny. Not like this though. I just want to show you this lovely mug that I got at TK Maxx in um, Newcastle the other week. And I actually bought it for my mum as a present. Oh, it's got a coffee drip on it there. Um, and then I kind of fell in love with it, so I had to keep it. It was in the sale, it was £10. So I just thought I'd quickly show you my lovely Emma Bridgewater mug of the day. I know £10 is quite a lot, but um, it's an Emma Bridgewater one. And it's just so beautiful. So I'm just having a quick coffee um, by my lovely new flowers, watching the crazy windy weather. Um, and I'm gonna have a shower in a minute and get ready for my gig. Because at the minute I look like this, so I need to have a shower and sort my face out and um, and my hair and everything, but it's so windy today. It's 10 to three now, and I'm just off for my afternoon gig at Hopton Holiday Park, or it might be Hopton Holiday Village, I'm not sure. Um, Toby's with my mum, he's all happy, and I am clean. My hair is much better than earlier, because it looks the right state, and I put my makeup on. Um, it's quite nice to do an afternoon gig, because then I get the evening free. Um, yeah, so I'm looking forward to tonight. I think we'll just, um, we bought that, those enchilada things. And what's the other thing? Enchilada and burrito. So me and Toby are gonna share them later and probably watch a film and just have a nice night in. It's still so windy though. Um, it bothers me when it's windy and you've just done your hair because it goes all funny, doesn't it? It goes all like separate, if you know what I mean, um, if that makes sense. So I'm gonna head over to Hopton and get ready for my set. I'm on at four o'clock, um, so I've got to do an hour today. And I love like, oh, it's a bit of fluff. I love the um, the owners at Hopton. It's a, like an owner's thing, people that own caravans. It's an owner's day, um, like a start of the season party. And I get on so well with all of them. Whenever I sing there, we have a great time. So I'm looking forward to today and hopefully it will be, yeah, hopefully it'll be a good gig. This is where I'm singing. Hopton Holiday Village. It's really nice here. It's a great holiday park. I've just got parked. I'm about to go in and I feel really nervous, like excited nervous. I don't know why. I think it's because it's quite a big day. Like there's lots of big acts on today. So hopefully it'll go well. I'm looking forward to it. I'm going to walk over to that door there and head in and go backstage. But the weather's come out quite nice again. It's sort of, I think the wind is has died down a little bit. So it's, yeah, it's quite nice now. It's really busy. There's loads of people here. City's on there. I'm backstage now and I feel a bit better. I'm more relaxed um, and I've got to do 45 minutes instead of an hour, which is always good. So I can do like my best songs. Um, but the room is amazing. It looks so nice. I hope you saw from that clip how big it is and the stage just looks lovely. And back here is really nice as well. So I'm gonna go through my songs and um, plan my set. I'm now, I'm, I am relaxed. I feel much happier. I think I was just a bit like anxious and excited. Um, there's so many people here. It's lovely to be asked to do things like this because usually I do probably smaller gigs. Um, so this is really nice to be singing on this big stage here. There's my name, After City. I'm 
I'm all finished. I'm back in the car. It is 5.30 and that went really well. I loved it. I, as, when I went on, I wasn't nervous. I was fine. Um, the crowd were lovely and the room was so nice. It's been done out beautifully and the sound was so clear. It was, yeah, it was great. So I'm going to head home now, get my pyjamas on and make the enchilada -y burrito things that I bought in Lidl earlier and me and Toby are going to have that for our dinner so I'll probably um, speak to you in the morning. It's Sunday morning now it's about quarter past eight and I'm just in bed I'm having a coffee in my Poundland mug that I got a couple of weeks ago um, and I'm about to watch um, the vlogs from last week when Ewan and Luke came up and I can't wait to see them so they're going to go on YouTube at nine o'clock so I'll link all three of those vlogs in the description below in case you want to go and watch it but yeah it's really it's, it was such a nice day so I can't wait to watch their vlogs and kind of relive it again and we went to Home Bargains as well so we will be doing hauls very soon in the next few weeks the weather is horrible today it's raining and it's really windy and the match has been called off so there's no football for Toby today. Sorry Tobes. Hello Rufus, how are you? Hello. <laughs> I just got some lovely pictures of Bestie on the stairs for Instagram. Thank you Bestie, some lovely pictures of you. It's one o'clock now, Sunday afternoon and we're just about to go out for a roast to the boathouse in Ormsby. Um, football was cancelled, I think I said just before, so there was no football match for Toby, which was really sad because he was looking forward to it, as was I. Um, but yeah, the weather's horrible, so it's probably the best decision because they've been covered in mud and falling over, you know, because it's slippery. So we're just off for lunch, and I just want to quickly show you my top that I'm wearing. I'm, I've got this scarf on. I've been wearing this loads lately. It was 50p from the car boot sale a few weeks ago. Um, I don't know it's from originally, but I just love it. Um, and this jumper says Fun Day on it. It's got a little, like, um, yellow and blue neck. And um, it's from Next. And I've never worn it before. It's been in my cub. And I was like, today is the day. Sunday fun day. So this is my outfit of the day. Blue boots, this skirt. And that I got from a car boot sale in the summer that I've worn so much. It was a pound. It's one of the best things I've ever bought. Um, so I'm feeling nice and cosy. It's got um, yellow and blue on the sleeves as well. And this is one of the last kind of full price, fairly expensive items that I've bought. Um, I think it was about 28 quid. So I've got a few things from like New Look and um, Asda, but they're normally quite cheap. So I probably wouldn't buy this again now because I obviously just shop mostly in charity shops and car boot sales. But I really like it. So I'm going to wear it and wear it a bit more because I've not worn it yet. So I'm going to go and get my mum. We're all going to pile in the car, head over to the boathouse for a big roast. Toby just read my jumper and what did you say? Um, it's normally a fun day on Sunday and it says fun day. Yeah. But it isn't today. Today is not a fun day Sunday for you, is it? Because no. of no football. No football match. It's a nice jumper though, isn't it? Yeah. Fun day. But yeah, probably should say Sunday fun, fun day. day, but it just says fun day. Why does it say fun? I don't even know. We've been up um, and got our roast. I've got so much on my plate. I didn't mean to get this much. And then mum's got hers. Got hers. Hello. Hello. Mum's wearing a top that I found at a charity shop, but it's too small for me. It's so nice. I think it's um, Hollister. It's lovely. I'm very jealous it doesn't fit me. The sun's come out now, so it's really lovely. We're going to quickly head to a bit by the river and Toby wants to have a quick play in the play area over there. Hello geese. Geese can sometimes get you can't they? I'm not going to go too close. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh I missed. <laughs> <laughs> we're just gonna head home now it's almost three o'clock we're gonna stop at the shop on the way back and get some pudding and then just have a nice afternoon of watching films a bit of football and maybe cups of teas and hot chocolate does that sound good yeah. yeah so thanks for watching i hope you enjoyed this vlog and That'll make sure you subscribe what's that yeah you've already had one haven't you so make sure you subscribe if you haven't done so and if you enjoyed the video give it a like and i will speak to you on friday what have i got coming up oh a bathroom makeover video for friday so i haven't got a haul for friday but we've been doing up our ensuite it's a good face um so i will have the ensuite makeover video i started it i think in december and obviously it's only just been finished so i will have that for friday then the following week will be home bargains a home bargains haul as well so thanks for watching i'll speak to you on friday see you bye
Thank you for watching the weekend vlog. Bye.